Yo, back again. Ah, I'm looking at buying some stuff. High booster shorts cost like $250. And the larger are, the cheaper they are, but like the less they're in stocks. Ah, fun. Boxing gloves cost like $300. Freaking regular shorts like $150. Jackets for the winter. $120. Like, who buy this stuff? Who does that? What the heck? Freaking compression shorts for eighty dollars? Get out of here! I make these shorts for the same fabric tills for cheaper price. Ah, I can't wait. Got me three sewing machines. Ah, need to get another sewing machine. Don't worry. Make my own stuff. F this crap. Fun. What the heck is this? Pair of shoes for two hundred fifty dollars. <laughs> Usually, I can probably go around and try to find the cheapest price for this stuff. When I say cheapest price, I mean like less than a hundred. I would never find this stuff less than a hundred. I hope they hand stitch the stuff, like handmade. Even then, that stuff should even be crafted that much. Heck, I can probably get a needle and freaking the things you make your own turn to jacket stuff. Don't know anything, but I do it anyway, and make the same stuff for cheaper price. What the heck? Funny. Hilarious. Laughable. Wow feck. This is very, very wow. Like extremely wow. I don't want anyone to talk about, oh, name brand stuff should cost more. It's, it's you y'all think these people are doing this stuff by hand? No, they're not. I have worked in a clothing factory before. No, they're not doing this by hand. They're doing this by machine. I make a logo on my clothes and probably get a cheaper sell it for a cheaper price. That's right, people. I worked in the factory making clothes, doing this with the sewing machine and stuff. Designing it. It's like making shoes. I don't know why they cost that much, but you know, whatever. Not a fun job. I mean, it would have been fun if it had stupid people, but you know, since stupid people is the norm for most people. Ah, <sighs> fun. Fun days. It's, what is this? It's like. I'm seeing underwears cost like $80 for two pairs. Like it's two underwear. Not underwear, hands. Who does this? I hope it's bulletproof and freaking wane proof and you can just urinate with and just go through your clothes it cost that much. For underwear. I'm not having that crap. Who does this? Well, I have friends that does this, and I laugh so hard when they get knocked down and get the stuff stolen. It's very funny. You walking down the street, oh, ha, 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 check out my new, check out my new pants, my new jacket. Ha, 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 someone just run up behind him, knock you out, like your jacket, my jacket now. I mean, if I did do that, I would be aware of it, but, you know, ha, ha, ha. This is funny, extremely hilarious. Yeah, that's right, extremely hilarious. Shorts cost thirty dollars. These shorts won't even last me long. Oh, I don't. I'm not saying. Okay, don't care. Don't care. I'm not. What is this? Gracie boxing gloves? Ah, uh, oh, no, 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 no. If I move into my place, or I just might move to another country. That is the plan. I'm not even gonna trip. No one's gonna stop me from making progress at all. Period. That's right. I said period. F this crap. These people don't even really import their items from other countries. They get it here. It's made by other countries. They get it here. And that's now you know why, why America is complaining about jobs. It's not the people fault. It's not immigration fault coming into America. You can blame the freaking politics. You know. Giving the other countries jobs, have them make the stuff, ship it to us, will cost import tax, call trade tax, call a whole bunch of other stuff, and now we have less jobs here. Hey, there you go. 
But that is a great choice if you look at it another way because they have factories over there instead of having factory heroes like people. Why you complain about our country? You're the dumb ones getting self made in your country because you know you have dirty factories, you're getting all that pollution there. You know? Smart chicken government, have everybody else do the dirty work. Well then, like, like car factories. Do you know how big a car factory is? Do you know how dangerous a car factory is? Do you know how much pollution that causes? Do you know how much dangerous to work in there was? Yeah, obviously. For those who never worked in a car factory before, it's intense, it's hot, and it's dangerous. Very dangerous. I'm following that freaking furnace. It's a done deal. Unless it's me. I handle the heat. But anyway. Regular Adidas shorts for $40? Get out of here. Ha, <laughs> this is laughable. Anyway, very laughable. I would never work in any form of factory again. I'm letting y'all know that right now. Unless it's a factory that I started up and built up. So much better. Anyway, something else. Clothes. It's expensive clothes. What's this? Champion clothes? But, oh man. It sucks being average size because a lot of people buy it, which increase the price on it, to increase the market on it, to make more come in. <sighs> the stupidity of it. First come, first serve is what I say. Anyway. What the heck is this? Oh my boss. Cthulhu, where are you? We need this. Oh my Shuma. For those who don't know who Shuma is, you obviously haven't read a Marvel comic book or a DC comic book before. It's Primal Chaos. I believe me what I'm saying. It's a fine person. Along with the mini angle ones. Don't even get me started on Vertigo comic books. So fun. And no, I don't like DC. DC made a deal with Marvel by doing a crossover, according to what I know, from what I read. But then DC made their version of comic books. Um, when they like, great job, great money made. When Marvel tried to make their version of comics, they cancel it in the middle, like, no longer, no arrangement, no agreement. Sorry, sucks to be you. That's right. That's how bad DC was scared of Marvel. I watch DC movies every night. I won't buy the movies. I mean, if somebody else is watching them. You know, I watch it. I want to support your movies. The only thing I supported DC was Injustice. No more. No more Injustice. Effing you guys. Yeah, I said it. F DC. If someone else have a comic book, say read this, read this. I'll read it, but I'm not buying a comic book. Marvel, I buy comic books. Unless they go all to Disney and Fox and I'm just going to stop buying them. Period. I mean, like Disney stuff. The only reason I play Kingdom Hearts because of, you know, it's Kingdom Hearts. One of the originals. Mixture of Square and stuff. But, you know, they sold out to Disney as well. Fox sold to Disney. Heck. CW sold to Disney. Heck. Next thing you know, BBC, CBS is selling to Disney. Take over the world, Disney. Good job. Umbrella Corporation mode. Next thing you know, Disney is going to get in a freaking security business and everything. Great job, Disney. Wonderful people. Anyway, back to clothes. I'm not hating. If I had them, I would be doing the same thing, but you know, destroy our competition. Anyway. Look at these pants, what the heck. Now, see, pants minimum should at least cost $15. The most for pants should at least cost $90, $100 in U.S. based on what they use for, like, construction pants or freaking, yeah, construction pants, no more. Construction pants, welding pants. Anything to deal with the chance of you getting, like, a rip. Not, like, the special heavy-duty jobs, like welding or chainsaw lumber and stuff like that you need chops for those chops at least cost a minimum of 80 to at least 150 dollars at least that's just y'all price not even that's what i consider y'all price range should be if it's my price range 
it'll at least cost about 130 to $80. I ain't not dropping the middle on that. Next thing, say it's the fabric material cost more. Well, you should talk about some of us, make it cheap. You get some materials from the planet itself. How hard is it? Unless y'all monopolize it. Oh, this is our mine and stuff. Ha 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 ha. Our private property. Anyone want is like $5 billion to get some materials from it. That's right. I said $5 billion. But anyway. That's right, people. I may be black, but I'm smart. I'm not black, I'm brown. My apologies. I said black because it's something on y'all. I said I'm brown. Up that. Yes, it's freaking black. See, there's two different skin colors brown. But go for it. Anyway. Jeans cost $80. Oh my balls. Cthulhu, where are you? Heck, forget Cthulhu. Dagon, where are you? Ah. <sighs> The only two type of pants I would wear. Pants that are meant for construction and stuff like that are khakis. Any other pants I would wear is most likely just gonna be for fighting or running. Fighting or running. Who knows? Nothing else. I'm not wearing any other form of pants. You got those freaking caprice jeans that so hard on the crotch, like it fix your waist size and fix your height size, but it's so hard on the crotch area. It's just stupid. Then you got darkers that, you know, extremely good on the sides, but it's just not good for the crotch area. Nothing's good for the crotch area. That's right, I need space. Don't worry about the size, I need space to throw some kicks in it. Oh, my boss. Oh, I'm just putting stuff on here, then I'm prepared to everything else. It's straight up ridiculous. Don't even get me started on the shirts. That is ridiculous. That is super ridiculous. I saw a shirt on uh, a clothing store a couple of days ago for six hundred dollars. It just had a logo and a tag. Funny, literally funny. I'm <coughs> I'm not getting that shirt. You guys can get the name brand stuff while you want. And someone will come up behind you and knock you out. Hey, nice coat. This name brand. I like it. Thanks. Yoink. Have fun with that crap. Heck, even even I have people run up on me for some cheap clothes. It didn't go so well for them. It did not go so well for them. Ever. Heck. I was in a homeless shelter and I had like some $60 Adidas on. I slept with my shoes on if I can get up any time. Somehow those guys pointed out for me while I was sleeping. Heck, probably some probably put drugs in me while I was sleeping. That has happened before in a homeless shelter before people. Someone shot cocaine in my body. Didn't go so well for them. But you know. Didn't go so well. I mean, I was literally fighting the stuff off for the next week. But since my system is so clean... And then one of them tried to come up to me and say, hey, how's it going? We have this stuff to sell to you. Do I look that stupid? You are one of those people. Yeah, I wrecked his face. Lucky for them, they, lucky for them the terms of the agreement that please don't blah, blah, blah. But, you know, I don't buy it. Don't care. I'll be seeing them again very soon. I'll be seeing them very That individual. So I got the other two. I'll be seeing that individual very soon. And I'm going to go through the whole list of... You know, you like sticking cocaine in people? I got some new drugs for it. It called melt your face off. Literally, melt your face off. Don't worry. That's being guinea pig. I always want to test this stuff out. Just test it out. But anyway, next time. Yeah, people. Uh, someone took shoes off me while I was sleeping. First time for everything. Won't happen again. The last two people that tried it before they got dropped. That time, I didn't. It will never happen again. Fool me once. And only once. If fool me tries, great, you have skills. Fool me a third time. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. I'm not having that. Everybody dies. That's right. Everybody dies. Don't care. I'm pretty sure the person in bed next to me knew this was happening. Whoever owned the place knew this type of stuff. Ain't no one informing? Yeah, everybody dies. Everybody dies. I could go through the whole state. Oh, yeah, you like this. Oh, I'm sure you do. Yeah. 
Everybody dies. Don't care. You got kids? Everybody dies. Don't care. I don't care. Anyway, let's do this. Jackets for all oh my boss. Okay. The only type of two shirts I wear. Actually, four categories of shirts I wear. Button up shirts that are good, good for the interview to wear. Or walk into a work like in that shirt. A casual shirt that goes with the work. Another shirt that goes with an even harder work. And a regular shirt like this. I just, just, I don't really try to go out to the other shirts like, yay, look at me. New name brand stuff. Don't see the need for it. Don't see the necessary for it. Heck, I'll make a shirt that's name brand. Set them up for like $8. Deflex bullets. Reflex heat. Heck, allow you to see two objects and levitate. Not just me. Anyway, let's go. If anyone see a jacket for eight hundred dollars, if you buy it, have fun. Cause the fact that you found that jacket was eight hundred, I'm pissed. A thousand other people did. You should prepare the stuff come out your pocket. Have fun. It's ridiculous. Literally ridiculous. Oh, how much? Anyway, I mean, if I did, of course I know. First place to walk. Hey, nice jacket. Who does that stuff? Who allow a stranger to out of nowhere just to walk up on them? You can be in a crowded area. Who does that stuff? I mean, if you allow someone to walk up on you, if you walking anywhere and you don't look behind you, never look behind you, you didn't. You deserve to be hit in the face. I mean, you don't deserve it, but you had to assert that age where you should be checking your left and right constantly. It doesn't even matter the reason. You should just check it. And you have someone walk up on you out of nowhere and hit you in the back of the head or something like that. Heck, chill, whatever. You guys allow that? People? You people allow it? I'm going to laugh. So check your back. Don't worry. We go find those people. I have my ways of doing. I have resources. I have connections. Uh, what was it? I was in Boston while I was going to college. Of course. Like Harvard's right there, Boston, Massachusetts, right there, Bunker Hill is right there. Heck, freaking the stuff where I went for robotic science is right there. Someone took my uh, not my iPad. No one took it. Uh, touch touchpad. Of course, we made an agreement. We made a legal agreement for that person to buy my uh, touchpad for like two hundred dollars. You know, it was the best touchpad out there at that time. It cost me like four hundred dollars. Okay. That person didn't unify the agreement. I told that person you didn't unify the agreement. If you don't give me the agreement, you stole it. And of course, I will be looking for you. The person didn't unify it, so I went to the police. Hey, someone stole this stuff. Don't worry about how they got it. They stole it. What's the serial number? Here you go. What's the fix number? Here you go. Never went for like two, three months later. Come on, people. If you don't have enough police for this to do the job, fine. I'll do your job for you. Oh, yeah. We found it. Uh, I have the feeling that person was going to do that, so I made sure it did not work before I gave it to that person. You know, I know my category of people in a situation arises, in an environment, blah, blah, blah. Person did it. Oh, it doesn't work. Two weeks later, oh, yeah, yeah, where the rest of the money at? You could talk. But, you know, that didn't go right. I guess you can get whatever little money you have back in. I can get this stuff back. I'll be on the internet with tomorrow. Don't worry. But, you know, have fun. Anyway, anyway, the fun times. <sighs> no, I'm not buying these clothes. I'm just putting them somewhere if I can remember them. And then I'm going to compare the cheapest price. Then I'm going to try to look at something that's similar to it, but even cheaper. That's right, people. We don't do your job. I'm just gonna go cheaper. Heck, I'll probably make clothes and somebody do something like that. This is the cheapest price you can get a mic. Don't worry, I make your clothes for cheaper, which is why I'm gonna make sure you don't have the same skill level. 
I'll make my clothes where it's beyond your comprehension. If you can make it, kudos. Kudos to you. That's some highly skill right there. But, you know. That is some highly skill. If you can copy me. I mean, cheap invitation, but highly skilled. Highly skilled. Had to be highly skilled to copy me. Had my to copy right the way I walk. People might start stealing that crap. That's right, people. Copyright the way you walk. In the future, soon the government copyright when you spit. If you spit to the left and you spit to your right and you don't look up before you spit, copyright. My combination of things. Their combination of things, but you know, whatever. Anyway, let's get this. No way. Okay, good jacket. I give it the price. Like I said, cheap imitations do not compare to me. If I make something, I should know how to defend against it. It's like when I see anime and movies and freaking real life and stuff like that. It's like the creator of Jujutsu getting beat by someone just came out of nowhere. There is such thing as beginning with there is such thing as that zero zero point one percent when you start seeing moves that's yours and you get beat that's something wrong. You have A, not good at your stuff, or B, a fake. And, oh, I don't think this stuff really works. And if someone else prove it, yeah, you're fake. Anyway, that's just an example. It's like me making a car. Someone try to break into my car, and you don't think I have a way of knowing where my car is, or how to track it down, or freaking how to find my car. You are very, very hilarious to think I don't know. But anyway, it's like people stealing my stuff or something like that. Like, I'm missing underwear or that stuff for that. I would not care about my underwear, but i am lately been missing my underwear lately. It's like, just drop out of nowhere. I drew away like four pair of underwears and I have like 30, 40 of them. And now I can't find the rest of them. I mean, there's either a ghost coming to my place or, you know, someone stealing my stuff. But I tell my concern about underwear. Unless I do it for kicks and giggles. Hmm, I forgot that later. Like I said, as long as you walk on this planet, you are within my range of touching. Don't worry. Yeah, on this planet. Don't care. Everybody. Heck, you can walk. You can walk off this planet. You're still in my range of touching. But don't worry. I have ways. That's right. I have ways. Oh, my freaking boss. Dulu, where are you? That's right, I said it. If you're on this planet, I said it again. If you actually, as long as you would ever existed, you're in my range of touching. Well, we're gonna steal your stuff, ha ha. Someone said that, ha, you walk this planet, you're in my range of touching. Don't worry about it. It's like, well, was it? Yeah, I agree. Okay. I don't, that's not a great choice for you guys. If you're gonna like say with the whole city against you, that's good for me. I don't have to aim anymore. I can just spray. Hey, very bad. With the whole world against you, just fine by me. Then good job. Take out the core. Everybody goes down. We all go down. Yeah, bad choice of people. Bad choice of people. Very bad choice. That's why I don't like it, but I really respect those people who can like put a plug on their switches or people who stay behind like, oh, I got this, you're gonna die, yeah, I know, I got this, don't worry. Like, you gotta really respect that crap, but don't, don't worry, I'm fine. <sighs> oh God, he's close. I mean, and I don't want, oh, I know it. I don't want to hear y'all say it because you have to make a profit out for based on the materials and the resources, blah, blah, blah. If 
that is the case then guess what it will be even cheaper because like somebody's like mostly busy by the resource three times four times cheaper as a whole plus the hours to make it plus the hours to do it plus the manufacturing product plus giving out three times less than the actual prices most of them no you gotta make that eight hundred dollar profit per item plus tax and a more profit whatever Next thing you know, actually, people are gonna start raising the price on. Oh wow, f you, f that crap. Next thing you know, people are gonna start raising the price on water. You wanna drink in my ocean? Guess what? Well, ha, huh, funny. Unavailable. What the heck? These people make more than they're just a profit. They made long and they, oh my boss, what the heck? All right, all right, so listen. These people are making more than just a profit. They make enough to uh, supply the 50 generations down, supply whoever it does want, you know, kicks and giggles. But hey, like I said, if you want to support them, go for it. That make me make a business. I put every business out on this planet. I probably be assassinated, but you know, you're welcome to try. You are welcome to try. Like I said, you better have an anti-matter space cannon and freaking somewhere out the solar system to get me. There's that 0 0.01 chance, but you know, I'm well aware. Oh no, $30 for a button up shirt? What the heck? <sighs> $40. The prices go up. What the heck? Oh, the salt is real. Yes, I am really, really salty right now. I am very salty right now. Yeah, I said it. I'm salty. Very, I'm extremely salty right now. I can't just... <sighs>